What's going on people, it's your boy Haf, you're back on the Kit Lab. Today's episode, all about what you young goalkeepers should have in your goalkeeping bag. Right people, let's get to it. Your gloves and your boots, super essential, that goes without saying. Preferably double up to deal with any type of weather conditions. Cool, let's get to what's important to me on a match day. One of the most important things for me is my glove towel. Leave it in your goal, in your net, wherever you feel like it's comfortable for you. I use my glove towel to look after my gloves during games. So depending on the weather, my gloves might get dirty, so they might need a little wipe. So once you wipe them, they're back clean again, good to go. Next most important thing for me is the science and sport gel, yeah? This right here is super important for me. It keeps you on your toes, it gives you caffeine. So make sure if you're taking this and you're under the age of 16, it's probably best you ask your parents before taking one of these, because you probably won't sleep for weeks. But this for me, super, super important. If I don't pack one of these before a game, I'm finished. All right, boom, the next thing, wrist tape. All you goalkeepers that have floppy wrists like me, get yourself some wrist tape, wrap it over with both wrists, nice and tight, gloves over, very important for me especially. If I don't go into my games with some tape on my wrists, I feel like my wrists are a little bit weaker. They add a bit more comfort when it comes to your gloves as well, and they look good as well. So yeah, it's a win-win, get yourself some wrist tape. And the next few things are, obviously we spoke about the gloves earlier. So I've got these gloves for my warm-up, and then these are very, 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 very good gloves. One glove company, love, love, love their stuff. This is brand new gloves, so as soon as I'm done with these, go straight into these when we start the game. Also, Under Armour, blue Under Armour. I wear a blue kit at Haraborough. If you wear a different color Under Armour to your top, referee won't even let you out of the changing room. You have to take it off. Very important, you have the same color Under Armour than your kit. Your towel, so you stay clean after games, very important. Your wash bag, same sort of thing. Flip flops, very important guys. When you go up to a first team, it's important that you don't forget these things because you, you will get fined by the senior players and it'll cost you a lot of money. So don't forget these things here, very important. Resistance band, activation stuff. Even when you're in the change room before you go out for your warm up, it's good to get a little bit warm with the resistance band. Important for me. Then you've got your vapor rub. This is very important to me because I like to feel comfortable in my game. So rub a little bit, a bit of this on my chest feel nice and comfortable to go out, go out there. Any, any weather condition really helps. Pads, self-explanatory. Don't forget these. Fines again. And then hockey ball. Really good for your glutes to open up your glutes. Your glutes are tight, hamstrings are tight, calves are tight, even your feet, you can roll your feet. Very important activation again before game. So like in your change room, if your back's hurting you, Hockey ball, roll your back out on the wall, opens you up, makes you feel comfortable. You're prepared to go out there and win your games. Finally, you've got your undershorts. Obviously my undershorts are black because my shorts are black. Again, like I said, with the unders undershorts and undertops, if they're different color to what you're wearing on a match day, the referee won't even let you out of the changing room. So it's important that you buy things that are the same color as your kit. Don't waste your old tights. Like you see with these ones, I've cut them, so it's good because I just cut my tights that were old, that were ripped up, and now I use them as undershorts for my games. There you have it, people. That's how I would prepare on a match day. Remember, preparation is key, key, key. Give yourself every chance to go to your games as comfortable as possible and get the best results out yourself. Like, comment, and subscribe. It's your boy, Haf. We out.